I made some new merch. Link is in the description. Enjoy the video. Hello, welcome to Just My Thoughts. I'm yours, Khalil Ward. On this episode, I'll be talking about Pacific Rim, The Black, Season 2. It's an animated show on Netflix. Like I said, it took a while for Season 2 to come. It's only seven episodes, just like the first season. They're about like 20 minutes each. Uh, quick Season 1 recap. Uh, we meet Taylor and Haley. They are brother and sister. Uh, their parents are Jaeger pilots. Oh, if you don't know Pacific Rim terms, Jaegers are the big machines humans created to fight the kaiju, which are the big monsters that came from, like, under the sea. Anyway, they are left by their parents. The parents are like, we're going to come get you. Of course, they never come back. Years pass. Haley finds a Jaeger and accidentally, like, turns it on. And then that signals a kaiju. Um, and it comes and it kills everybody in her settlement except her brother and herself. So they are feeling pretty bad. They learn to pilot the Jaeger because to pilot, you have to be in sync with the, the other person, you know, and as brother and sister, they're a perfect match. Um, they go on this journey in the black. Uh, they meet this woman named May and she introduces him them to some other humans who are kind of evil and sadistic and want their Jaeger. They manage to escape. They also find a boy who was in this containment. They free him. They name him Boy because he doesn't speak. And he likes being around with them. They eventually come across that kaiju that they met in the first episode. And they kill it. And boy makes a transformation. That was season one. Season two picks up right where season one left off. Boy is what they call a hybrid. He's half human, half kaiju. And when it ends, you see this group who we learn are the sisters. And they're a very strange group. Uh, and they can control hybrids, mostly small at first. And then you see them control some some bigger hybrids. And they want Boy. They think Boy is what they call the Messiah. And they do anything to get Boy. So Taylor, he's he's the oldest. And he doesn't really trust Boy now that he found out he's like half human, half kaiju. But Haley is like really determined to help save him and try to protect him throughout. May doesn't really care too much because she's mostly a loner but she does stay with the group uh throughout this season and they grow closer as you know friends and family as they go through like the trials and tribulations of making it to sydney that's their whole goal make it to the sydney base because that's where their parents were supposed to be headed um and season two is a little bit more emotional it's not so much focused on getting better with the the jaeger because in season one, they had to learn how to pilot, they had to learn how to fight and make adjustments to the Jaeger. Now they pretty much have that down. Um, I think the, the Jaeger's communication, the AI is called Lola, and they talk to her often and they have that they have that bond. So they, it's not really mo about figuring out how to fight. It's more human and more emotional as they're trying to find their the rest of their family. So it's it's a different change of pace from the first season, but I enjoyed it. I, I enjoyed the interactions we got. I enjoyed Taylor and ha um, Haley button heads about what to do with Boy. They like they constantly are arguing about, you know, how they should proceed with Boy because at sometimes he's he transforms into a kaiju and then other times he is a little boy and he's not harming anyone. So, it, you know, it, it's a it's a conflict. Um, I would say the latter episodes, like five, six and seven, we get a little bit more combat with kaiju, with different size kaijus. Um, they are categorized, you know, category two, category three, and we eventually meet a category, category six, and it's not an easy fight. So the season has its ups and downs, and it flows where it's like a lot of human interactions and things like that, and then it goes into the Jaeger kaiju type battles. So for a second season, and I don't know if it, if it's gonna get a third season, like season one left on a cliffhanger, you know, for season two. Season two doesn't leave us, you know, with any with wanting anything. So I don't know if we get a season three, but if we don't, I would say it's a solid two seasons. You know, 14 episodes goes by pretty easily. Um, but if you like animated stuff, if you enjoyed Pacific Rim, the movies, I would say check it out. But those are just my thoughts. Thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. Deuces.